talk to us a little bit about the fact that recently there's been a tremendous amount in the press about the possibility of restricting opiates to a certain dosage amount as well as a certain number of pills for people. Could you speak to that from your perspective, please? You bet. Um, I have a horrendous issue with that kind of anything legislative or anything even, um, even if it's an unsaid culture that's starting to develop for lots of reasons. First of all, we may see patients are comfortable and very functional at a dose or a number that may seem extremely high for one practitioner or the other. Um, we may see that the patient stays comfortable and functional and awake and alert um, on an amount that you and I might not be able to take. So lots of misunderstandings. We can't prescribe according to um, a dose that's legislated or um, we can't prescribe or treat according to an amount that someone may feel is appropriate because it's all about what that patient needs and that can be soup to nuts um, so no it, the same issue about uh, medicating according to a pain number or a pain scale um, we may be keeping a patient at a one or two on their level because they're taking a thousand milligrams of some medication an hour. That may be the dose that's their recipe or their formula.